come on, shape shift with me. Against me are one of my favorite bands of all time. They are my 10th favorite band of all time. And I am devastated that they are breaking up. That was an Against Me reference. But Laura Jane Grace has a new solo single. So let's check it out and see if it gives us Against Me vibes or if it even needs to. Let's just jump right in. Dysphoria Hoodie is a really unique title for a song and it immediately took me back to my high school days when a hoodie was my shelter. It was everything. They were inevitably stolen by, they were stolen by romantic possibilities. But that, the romance side of things, that's a whole other video. In fact, romantic possibilities in my life, that's a whole other channel. We gotta get the we gotta get the magic eraser, the acoustic guitars. We don't have to get the acoustic guitars. Let's put a put all the props away. So now we're here. I'm gonna tell you right now, this is a very stripped back song by Laura Jane Grace. None of that magical rage, uh, that guitar brimstone and fire from Shapeshift with me. Oh man. Sonically, this song is Laura Jane Grace and an acoustic guitar. And that's it. Whoa, hell yeah! The lyrics here, we got to get a little bit more comfortable. Right? The lyrics here are more relatable than even I would like to admit on camera. And it paints a vivid picture within my head as I listen intently to the song. A Saturday morning with weed and coffee. It's a strong visual that really crawls inside my soul as I'm listening to this song. And it reminds me of a conversation that I had with an old friend. And also that maybe I have a problem with coffee. Oakland Coffee. Please sponsor me and give me free Oakland Coffee. I think Green Day put drugs in the coffee. Oh, and speaking of sponsors, no, I don't have sponsors for this video. Don't worry. And I don't think Laura Jane Grace is being paid by Adidas either, but that would be cool if she is. Uh, that is right, ladies and gentlemen. The titular, <laughs> the titular, the titular hoodie in question is an Adidas black hoodie and I think Laura Jane Grace is recalling the Adidas song from Corn with a K. I never thought in all the days that Laura Jane would be writing lyrics about corn lyrics. But Earth, this Earth is a fabulous haven for beauty sometimes. And I'm all about it if that's really what it's about. Against me, corn. All day I dream about sex. All day I dream about something. I usually dream about animals like wolves and birds and dinosaurs. I'm not even in a lot of my dreams, which is weird. I also really like the stark contrast between those thoughts of Adidas. What Adidas, the, the acronym Adidas stands for and thoughts of Jesus. I, I thought that that was a nice juxtaposition and we all know that saying juxtaposition, it gets Fantano views. And I, I'm i kind of like the next Fantano um, with the hair and the busyness and all. Second verse isn't as personal, but it does necessarily uh, do some world building in the song structure. Uh, before getting back to the good stuff about Jesus and Adidas and sex. For a song that's 2 minutes and 34 seconds, 2, 3, 4, uh, we do get a lot of lyrical candy. And in the third verse, Laura Jane Grace or Jora Elaine J. Grace, I almost got that right, says she might wear, She's gonna wear that hoodie like it's 1981. Sorry, leave a comment if you know what that reference is. Laura Jane Grace says she's gonna wear this protective 
hoodie, this protective armor for 27.39 years. I did the math for you. But 27.39 years doesn't sound very cool. It doesn't sound very punk rock. And that, and you know, being the lovely lady that she is, Laura Jane uses the more lyrical 10,000 days, maybe more. Very artful. I review music and I talk music news here on the channel and uh, get very giddy when talking about anything Laura Jane Grace has in hand, in store, in mind, in her Adidas hoodie. Get it? Hand in. Didn't quite land that joke. This is a 4.7 out of 5 song. It gets minus 0.3 points because Laura Jane Grace hasn't called me yet. Let's get matching Adidas hoodies, bitch! 